Mendes and today I'm just doing a quick video on three things not to do on Instagram. Now as you can see, I'm just having a little walk along the beach front, it's been raining but I reckon I've got about a half hour little gap to go for a walk so that's why I'm doing this now. So the first thing not to do on Instagram is to be spammy and that really means like don't go on other people's profiles and pictures and start saying, you know, um, here you can make a million dollars in, you know, by pushing this button or, you know, spend $20 and $10,000 a month. It's just bullshit, really. And don't get sucked into doing that because it doesn't work. It attracts the wrong kind of people that aren't going to stick around and be business builders anyway. It's just really a loser kind of formula. Now, another thing I see that I just cringe at is really kind of, um, I go and find pictures and they're, they're like, you know, they're like this, you know, or um, flashing the money everywhere. And it's just, again, it's just that spammy. These are the kind of people you're gonna attract. You know, if you don't wanna hang out with people like that in your real life, well, you don't wanna be following and connecting with people like this on Instagram either. And people are not gonna be attracted to you. Um, be, you know, lead from the heart and be, give value and then people will want to follow you. Now the third thing is about using hashtags. Now we use a lot of hashtags to attract different people so you can use the hashtags like network marketing, network marketing rock stars, um, love, um, bliss, beach, you know anything that is related to your photo. What I'm going to say is don't use negative hashtags. So if you say crap day, I hate my job, they're the kind of people you're going to attract to your Instagram account and get those people are going to be around you. They're the whingers and whiners and they're not business builders and they won't buy stuff from you because they'll be whinging about every five cents that they spend. You don't want them in your business. Alright, so I hope those three tips helped you. Go on Instagram, lead by the heart, give value and you will actually create a huge following on your Instagram. Now, if you want to know exactly how you can use Instagram to build your network marketing business, I have some free training for you that will get you going. Click on the link below this video or go to tracyrose.com forward slash Instagram dash training. So click on that link and go and get that free training now.